video, we are going to solve a problem on finding the transfer function of a system. This is the circuit and for this circuit we have to find out the transfer function. So let's solve it. First we will find out the equivalent impedance of this parallel combination of the capacitor and the resistance R1. So suppose Z1 is the equivalent impedance. Of this parallel combination of C and R1. So the value of this Z1 will be. The parallel combination solve it. So R1 and into 1 upon j omega c so z1 will be r1 by j omega c this j omega c and j omega c they can be cancelled out So Z1 will be equals to R1 upon 1 plus J omega C R1. Now, if we apply the Kirchhoff's voltage law in this loop, so it will be given by the KVL states that the algebraic sum of the voltages in a loop is equal to 0. So let's write the KVL for this loop. This parallel combination can be replaced by Z1. So VIT will be equals to Z1 and multiplied with the current IT plus R2 IT. And this V0 T, it is the voltage across the resistance R2. So V0 T will be equals to R2 IT. So these are the two equations which we have obtained. Now take the Laplace transform of these two equations. The Laplace transform of the second equation will be V0 S equals to R2 IS and the Laplace transform of the first equation will be VIS equals to Z1 IS plus R2 IS. So these are the third and the fourth equation. Now transfer function, it is the ratio of the Laplace transform of the output and the input. So what is your output and what is your input? You have to take the ratio of that. So output is V0 and input is VIT. 
So we have to take the ratio of V naught S and V I S. Putting the values of V naught S and V I S, we will get R2 IS by Z1 IS plus R2 IS. IS can be taken out and it can be cancelled. So we will get V naught S and VIS is this equal to R2 by Z1 plus R2. Now putting the value of Z1 which we have obtained earlier. So Z1 was equal to R1 plus 1 plus J omega C R1. So let's put its value. So let's solve it. The denominator term, it will go in the numerator. Now, let's multiply it, we will get If we take this R2 upon R1 plus R2 as common, then we will get R1 plus R2 is already taken as common. So here we will have 1 plus Now if we suppose this R2 upon R1 plus R2 as a constant given by A and this CR1 it is taken as the time constant then V0S by VIS will be given by A 1 plus J omega can be written as S because S is equals to J omega. So S, CR1 is P, the time constant, divided by 1 plus J omega is again S. R2 upon R1 plus R2 is A and CR1 is P. So the transfer function will be V naught S by V I S equals to A 1 plus S T upon 1 plus S A T. So this is the transfer function of the system. I hope you have understood this question. Thank you.